This is an ABC 10 News update. Hello, I'm Jared Ahrens with this ABC 10 News update. The new bivalent COVID boosters are now available at CVS and Walgreens pharmacies in San Diego County. Online appointments to get the new booster are open. This includes both Pfizer and Moderna's updated shots, which specifically target the Omicron subvariants BA4 and BA5. People eligible for the new booster can get either kind. Doesn't matter what your original shot was, as long as it's been two months at least since your last booster. Excessive heat is causing problems for some schools in the Poway Unified School District who are dealing with air conditioning issues. Students at Midland Elementary School will have a minimum day today be released at noon. And students at Bernardo Heights Middle School and Rancho Bernardo High School will also get out early because the district says the brand new installed chiller could not provide enough AC for both campuses. So Bernardo Heights students get released at noon for the rest of the week. Rancho Bernardo High students at 1:15. With another hot day in store, electricity demand could reach another all-time high. On Tuesday, we set the record for demand at over 52,000 megawatts. That beats the record of 50,000 from back in 2006. So Cal ISO ordered another flex alert for today from 9 p.m. 4 to 9 p.m. That is eight straight days of flex alerts. Here's Vanessa Paz with a look at our steamy forecast. Vanessa? Steamy is correct. Pretty accurate there. So record-breaking energy we're using and record-breaking temps that we're expecting later on today, especially for the inland communities. Today's highs along the beaches will be comparable to yesterday. We'll be in the mid to upper 80s along the beaches with a light breeze. Elevated fire danger remains the case for the inland valleys all the way to the deserts. Inland communities will be in the low hundreds, 80s for the mountains and near 110 in the deserts. Jared. For the latest news, weather, and traffic, go to 10news.com or you can download our free 10 News app in the App Store. For ABC 10 News, I'm Jared Ahrens.